Down here. Mummy, have a look. You've got half your dinner. Look. What's this, Lenny? It's all that. <laughs> yum, yum, yum. Just going to give him one of these little malt loaf bars for his pudding, which he absolutely loves. He's covered in bolognese. Look at the state. Hi everyone, hope you're all really well. Welcome back to my channel. So tonight we're gonna to do a bit of a evening routine, then his bedtime routine. I did his morning routine the other day. So I thought we'd do a evening routine to follow on from that. We've just finished our tea. We've tried Noki for the first time tonight and I've never had it before. He's never had it before and it was good, wasn't it? Yeah. Did you eat it all up? Yeah. Yeah. But he definitely needs a bath now because he's absolutely covered in sauce. I would say head to toe, probably. You're covered. So it looks like he's been tangled because he's covered in orange sauce. So we're going to go get a bath now. It is ten past six now. So we're going to have a bath, chill out, and then it'll be bedtime before we know it. Ben is still working late, it's still harvest, so it is just you and I, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it's just you and I. Yes. So we're gonna go get him in the bath now because he is filthy. How is dressed in a toddler so hard? Ugh, it's just, it's exhausting. They just hate to get dressed, hate to get dressed. And how are they so strong? It's, I don't even know how he is that strong. He hates getting dressed, hates having his nappy changed. He just wriggles and fights. Yay. Thank you. Ta. But his dress is in his pyjamas. And you smell beautiful now, don't you? We've come back downstairs now. Lenny's just having a little look through his little books. You love your books, don't you? Press these buttons. So he's making noise. Can you press them? <laughs> oh, 
かしたLenny is still on the man bottles for his milk. I have tried to change them over. I literally, the other night, I tried with so many different cups. I purposely bought this cup, a Tommy Tippy one, for him to have solely just for milk. Um, I didn't want him to have the normal cups he has for his water, for his milk, because he associate his milk bottle to nap time so he has a morning bottle and he has his nighttime bottle and i'm i'm 99.9 percent .9 sure he associates that with like nap time bedtime and things and he gets excited when he sees it so that's why i wanted like one dedicated bottle for milk so the other night we tried it with the new bottle that i bought and he had a, a tiny tiny little bit not a lot and then spat it out literally spat the milk out like there was something wrong with the milk um yeah right yeah um yeah he spat the milk out like that there was something wrong with the milk and then i tried another one of the bottles that i know he drinks from with water wouldn't have that and i went through every cup that we own to see if he'd take it his milk from that what's the matter darling he's getting frustrated with his toy um yeah every cup that he has with water i tried with milk and he was literally spitting out like there was something wrong with the milk um and um, i put it back into the man bottle because that like, isn't literally not going to take this and he took it straight away so um we're in a bit of a predicament with changing bottles at the moment we're sticking with the man bottle for now and then we're going to try again maybe in a couple of days but i'm going to try it and change the morning milk feed rather than the nighttime milk feed um because then he won't be hopefully as tired and it's not right before bedtime yeah. yes yeah. so in future we're going to try the morning bottle that way yes see how it goes we can we can just might just have to persevere with it and see how we get on but for now nighttime he has his man bottle he um He's on full fat cow's milk now as well. We changed that over when he turned one. So you're on the... You're on cow juice? Yeah. Right, let's so go up to upstairs and have your bottle. And read a book. The bedtime. Back up them stairs. Bedtime. Oh, big steps. Keep going. I'm right behind you. Keep going. Chop, chop. Go, 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 go. Oh, 
on a night time, as always, we've got his white noise machine. This one is the one that doubles up as a night light as well. So we always have this on and we have it on, what's loud? We have it on continuous. So we've got that and I'll put that back on in a minute for him. And it also goes to bed with his comforter elephant blanket, which he absolutely loves. Where have you gone? Yeah, I can hear you. I can see you in the mirror. What are you doing? Want your milk? Lenny always sleeps in his little sleeping bag as well. This is just a one tog one. So depending on the weather and how warm it is, he either just sleeps in this or he'll sleep in his pyjamas and this at the moment because it's really thin. Um, But tonight it's quite cooler than what it has been so he'll have this on top of his jammers he doesn't sleep very well without a sleeping bag we've tried it before and he will not settle so he has to have a sleeping bag on when it was really warm a few weeks ago we tried to put him to bed without a sleeping bag on just because it was that warm and he would not settle at all i think he associates a sleeping bag to bedtime as well because he's always had a sleeping bag on since he was like newborn so he wouldn't settle at all we tried everything and yeah so we just have to go with a really thin sleeping bag for him bless him so right i'm gonna get him in this have his bottle shall we read a um, good night tractor yeah. yeah and it's bedtime the stars are out it's time for bed so say good night my sleepy head good night farmer good night plow good night trailer good night cow we're going to the next page yeah, one minute. Good night donkey, good night duck. Good night pig and good night sheep. Good night tractor, time to sleep. Dog and donkey, duck and cow, combine wagon, truck and plough. Oinks and brays and moos and bars, quacks and nays and moons and stars. Good night all, no count the sheep. Good night tractor, time to sleep. I've just had to go back into him because he'd chucked the elephant comforter out of the cot. He's wide awake, but he's chilled out. So hopefully he doesn't chuck the comforter back over the cot again. Because once he chucks it over, he is not happy. He's currently laid with it on top of his head. He's wide awake. Hopefully he'll go off soon. And Love Island um, reunion is on tonight, so I'm going to go upstairs, get my makeup off, fancy hot chocolate, I think I'll have a hot chocolate, get my dramas on, and I think I'll have an early night and watch the Love Island reunion in bed. And hopefully he goes to sleep soon, because he looks absolutely full of life at the moment. <laughs>
I completely forgot that I needed to do some eggs for Ben's pack up for his sandwiches for work. So I'm currently stood here boiling some eggs. I'm gonna put our leftover tea in the freezer. I always try to make far too much. So then when it comes to a day that I can't bother to cook or I can't think of something to make, I've always got a little stash in the freezer and that portion will do me and Lenny perfectly as well, especially with harvest at the minute. I am only cooking for me and Lenny because Ben's at work all the time. So uh, when was the last time we seen Ben? <laughs> Um, I don't know. He has been home, but when he comes home, I'm asleep. And when he goes to work, I'm asleep. So, um, might have been, what day are we on today? Sun it's Sunday today. It was a week ago. Last Sunday was the last time I seen him, even though we live together. Um, yeah, harvest is not fun, but... It's only seasonal work. I'm just grateful that it's not all year round and it's not a temporary kind of thing. It's just, it's not a permanent type kind of thing. It's just temporary. Um, it's only seasonal. I can do it. And so far, touch wood, dare I say it, it hasn't been that bad. We've, we've, we're nearly halfway there and we've had lots of busy days. We've spent a lot of time out and like we've got another camping trip coming up. So, I think keeping myself busy and occupied and going out and seeing people and what have you, it's definitely making the time go quicker. Um, but yeah, so far, so good. Wouldn't like it to be like this all year round. I am ready to have my partner in crime back, but um, yeah, soon be the end of September, October time, and then it should start quietening down a little bit. So yeah, anyway, I'm going to Get on with these sandwiches and hopefully my hot chocolate will have cooled down by the time the sandwiches are done and then I can watch Love Island at nine. <laughs> 